Hello everybody, Courtney here from How to Loom Your Dragon. I decided to just upload a really short and simple tutorial today of the bone for your poodle. So this is dedicated to all of you who have made the little poodle. Alright, so I'm just going to show you how to make this cute little bone. You can stick it in the poodle's mouth. Very adorable. I had actually wired this bone but you actually don't need to. I put wire through it so that it stays straight, but you, it's, it looks all right without the wire too as well. All right, so for this tutorial, you're gonna need about 80 bands of whatever color you want the bone to be. I am using white and you do only need one loom. <laughs> this is probably going to be my easiest tutorial that I've ever done. So let's get started. So I'm gonna use white again. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take four white bands at a time. Okay, so there's four. And I'm gonna go down 10 times. So four bands at a time going down 10 times. Try not to let them get too twisted up. Okay, try to put them on your loom so they're not all like sloppy looking. Okay, so I went down 10 times. Now I'm gonna take three bands at a time. Okay, so three, I'm gonna put them like this. Three more, like this. Three more like this. Three here. Three here and three here. Okay, let's go to the bottom. I'm going to put three here, three here, and three here. And here, here and here. Now I'm just going to take one white band and cap off right here, wrap around like, I'm just going to do three times for that one. It can be three or four times, doesn't matter. Then I'm going to start in here, go under your cap band, grab the top three bands and we're going to loop downward. Okay, then we're going to go down and we're going to grab these three here, loop up, and loop up to here. Go back in here, grab these three, loop them downward, oops, dig down, grab the bottom three. You can kind of use your finger to push the bands down so they don't lift up as you loom. Okay, loop that guy, and now we want to do this guy. Now here's a thick set, so we just want to, if you need to look into the side of your loom, do that. Okay. Loop up. Loop up. Now I'm gonna go in here and grab these three, so the top three, Oops. and like we did before, we're gonna loop them downward. And we're gonna loop up these three, and these three. Okay, then grab the next three, loop them downward to the other side. Loop these up, 
and loop these up. And then just grab these four and loop them up as well. Now I'm gonna take two white bands. I'm gonna go all the way down here and I'm gonna tie a slip knot through all those bands. Okay, tie a slip knot. And then I'm going to take it off. So once you've taken it off, we can kind of, the, t the bottom part is shaped nicely, the top part's a little off, so we can kind of tug on the two sides, tug them upward. Okay, so it looks like that. Okay, then we're going to take these loose bands here, take your hook, go into some random bands in the bone, pull the loose bands through like that, then just kind of just want to hide them in there so just go through some random bands and pull them through till they're all hidden okay and there is your bone again you can wire it up and give it to your poodle which you love <laughs> spent all that time on the poodle all right all right and there you go everybody I hope you enjoyed definitely check out my poodle tutorial if you haven't yet okay and that's about it so have a good day, everybody. I will see you soon for the next tutorial.